Hey, welcome back to Danae's Backyard Garden. And y'all, I think I'm ready. I think I got everything I need to begin canning. So on a video I did earlier, I talked about this book I got from the library. Got it from the library. I'm going to write down recipes out of it or I can just keep renewing it. But I'm going to go and show you guys all the different supplies that I have. Um, so this is why I believe I'm ready. So first off, <clears throat> actual pressure canner. I got a 16 quart Presto pressure canner. I know it's not 23. It's not the really big one, but it's a decent size one because, um, I don't need a big one. <laughs> why not? And I believe let's see how much this one can hold. Um, let's see. It says it somewhere on here. I have it. Here it is. So I can get 12 half paints, 10 paints, and 7 quarts in this pressure canner. I have not opened it yet because I think my first uh, canning experience is going to be water bath canning to get my feet wet. So with that being said, water bath canner. Got my water bath canner. Got the insert that goes on the inside so you can, you know, lower your stuff, your can down in there. So this is my big water bath canner. It's huge. Okay. Then, of course, we talked about the book. I went to the dollar store today and got a dish drying mat and a towel to match. So, of course, when I'm done um, canning, I can put my mat here to put my cans on and this to help drip everything over and to cover it up after the, for the 24-hour period. Got me a liquid measuring cup. I have a dry, but I need a liquid too, just to make sure. I don't know where my liquid one went, but I got a fresh one just for canning. I have the canning and pickling salt because, you know, you can't use iodized salt. So I've been picked this up. Then I got the ball utensil set. So inside of that came the funnel, the debubbler. Or the headspace, um, in the headspace, uh, measure. And then also, uh oh, it also has the grippers or whatever. What is this called? The tongs? It says jar, the jar lifter. The jar lifter, y'all. So yeah, with that being said, I think I got everything I need. I do have some jars, some of the small, um, what are they called? Let me start getting my language together. The small, um, Half paints I have, but I still have to get more, but I just have to decide on what I'm going to actual, actually can so I know what size to use. I think I'm going to start off with maybe a jam or a jelly, but it's almost time to harvest my potatoes, so I may be canning those. I don't know, but I just wanted to show you guys all of my supplies. I'm ready for this canning journey. I'm excited. I'm really excited to try. Like I got a lot of tomatoes coming up out there and I want to be able to make my own tomato sauce and salsa and just on this road of self-preservation or at least eating healthier, having healthier options for, options for my family. So thank you guys for watching. This has been a quick video just showing you guys my supplies, my pressure canner, water bath canner, all the supplies that go along with it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you come back again. Check it next time.